Minor League Baseball is finally back and a new season usually brings some changes and questions. A new roster, maybe a new mascot, but what about at the concession stand? And there's one big switch that has fans asking the question, why? We're going totally cashless, a lot of other ballparks are going cashless. Um, so when you come to the ballpark, you're ready to use your debit card, credit cards. Uh, there will be gift cards available, but as t the season goes on, it's going to be completely all cards. Uh, you find it at all the, all the major ballparks, so now the minor leagues are starting to get into it and push more. Now that your payment options are sorted out, the next question is, what new eats are in store for opening day and beyond? Well, one of the big things is a stand called Sweet and Boozy. Uh, it's based out of Katy, Texas. They're gonna come here. It's gonna be alcohol-infused ice cream. It's gonna be little eight-ounce cups, working on a liquor license as well. And uh, so but we'll have wine spirits and RTDs ready to drink. So things like Mosca Mules, uh, rum and Cokes could be available in cans uh, during the season at some point this year. Well, what about your fan favorites? Are they sticking around? Uh, we still have Philly cheesesteaks. We still have our uh, giant uh, jumbo hot dogs with peanut butter and jelly and bacon in them. That's a big one. A lot of people love those. We'll sell anywhere between uh, 50 to 250 a night. So that's, that's a pretty good amount of hot dogs with peanut butter and jelly and bacon. We've answered a lot of questions so far. So here's the last one. What makes eating at this ballpark a must? I think, uh, I think a lot of fans like coming here. Uh, it's very family oriented, a lot of fun, as well as you can bring like your friends, come on like a Thursday, Thursday, and then come back on a Saturday with your family and enjoy fireworks.